Ahoy there, this is Captain Horf. I'm playing another game of Brogue. So let's get started. So I figured out what was wrong with my microphone volume. I actually feel like a bit of a dunce uh, for not being able to figure it out sooner. Um, so I apologize to people for the inconsistent volume in some of these videos. I actually considered deleting a couple of them with the lower volume, but I figured, nah, why delete videos that are already up? I think everyone's going to get a little exposure to my evolution as a YouTuber since I'm still rather new to this. Look at all the water on this floor. So I just figured I'd leave them up, especially since one was almost an hour long and actually quite a good game in which I got to level, I believe, 14. So I figured it shouldn't be that big of an issue, but I do apologize to those people who are watching on the playlist and have to keep fiddling with their volume. From now on, this sh should be the standard volume that all my videos are at. And I'm going to try to stay consistent with that so that no more volume fiddling needs to be done. If you hear me mute my mic, it's probably... Oops, that was accidental. Didn't really need to pop that blood wart. Alright, i got to sneeze. Hold on. All right, turned out to be a sneeze tease, so even worse. So now I just feel like I need to sneeze and I can't. Anyway, just allergies. Okay, I see a weapon in here. An axe, that's not a bad weapon. If I can get a few pots of strength. That's not how I should have handled those guys, but they're jackals, I can be a little sloppy. Alright, it's a monkey. As you guys know from my other videos, I'm not so good at keeping my allies alive. So, oh! Drop that guy in his sleep. So, I'll try, but I'm not going to stick my neck out for this monkey. I also find it especially hard to keep allies alive when you get to that point where you're use IDing your scrolls and potions and such, because there's always some effect that's it's not going to kill you, but... Oh, thanks for the help, monkey. It's not going to kill you, but the monkey's not smart enough to get out of the way quick enough for, for whatever reason. Well, that was a pretty barren floor overall, even though I did find a pet monkey. Alright. So, obviously, we want to throw a dart. Always trigger pressure plates. I'm going to see if I can avoid popping that. Uh, I may need that as much for my monkey as for me. Alright, open the treasure room. A ring of light, wisdom, transference, and stealth. Well, since I'm already finding decent weapons, and because I normally don't get to do melee builds on this video, uh, I know I can just do this and find the right one. Transference. Okay. I'm going to use the ring of transference. Maybe we can get a decent melee fighter going this game. We'll see. So, clear this room. Alright, we're going to pop this goblin. While he's sleeping. Get, get in there so that my monkey can get hits on him too. Whenever possible, I'm going to try to turn the tables. One thing you learn in roguelikes is to stay in tight corridors so as few creatures can hit you as possible. Well, when you have allies, you want to do just the opposite. You want to be in more open spaces where your allies can get hits off as well. I'm just trying to dart this goblin down. All right, keep the monkey alive. Keep the monkey alive. I don't have, my pack is already full. Alright, I guess the best thing to do at this point would be, I'll kill this rat, would be to start IDing some of this stuff. So, scroll remove curse. That's enough to pick up that. I 
I'm just really antsy about... Okay, my pack is too full again. So I'm going to use... Let's use the ones we have two potions of. Alright, telepathy. Not bad. Um, use a scarlet potion. Fire immunity. That's actually great. Uh, I feel more confident ripping through these other potions. Knowing if I catch on fire. Potion of life. That's great. If I catch on fire, it's not going to kill me. Probably kill my monkey. That's a potion of strength. That's the one I was looking for. Potion of invisibility. Scroll of enchantment. What I want to enchant. I have plate armor. I'm going to enchant the plate armor. Um, scroll of aggravate monsters. That means I probably want to dive soon. Luckily, oh god, there's a whole section of the level I haven't explored yet. Well, this way I can keep an eye on the monsters and where they are. Maybe I can surprise this one. Surprise! Jerk face. Oh yeah, I'm invisible, so of course I can surprise it. Alright, I think that's the rest of this level explored, so that's all I needed to do to... As long as I don't go through this door, which of course they went through our door. That one's not going to... No, no. Well... Ugh. I hate monkeys. And that monkey I don't have to deal with, so... Beautiful. And I wanted to keep my telepathy while I was on this floor. I'm darkened too, which is not good. But... It's like I'm closing I'm closing the physical eye and opening the mind's eye because I have telepathy. Oh god, this jelly is coming for us. Monkey, could you kindly stack up right behind me? And stay there. Good monkey. Good monkey. Oh, why did I call you worthless monkey? I didn't mean it. I have a ring of wisdom. Thanks to my transference, I'm not really taking damage. Alright, uh, here's another room that looks good for uh, protect armor, waste. Identify. What do we want to identify? What do we need to identify? I guess we'll identify another one of these scrolls. Scroller recharging, that's a great one to Oh god. Get out. That hurt. Somehow that didn't hurt my monkey. Alright, well let's move on. I see a toad. Don't fight it, monkey. Clash of the monkeys. I want my monkey to win though. Alright. I knew that was a toad. Um, I don't have any idea what any of this crap is. I think my monkey's dead. I can't even tell. Nope, that's my monkey. That's another ration of food. I'm doing good on food for once. And I survived that hallucination. That was a little scary. Oh my god. Ugh. Let me tank a monkey. I can regen. You can't. I need that blood wart. Come on, monkey. I'm gonna get you some healings. Let me take the van. Alright, apparently I bonded with the monkey when I wasn't paying attention because now I can see what he sees. Heal up, monkey. And bonding with the creature is one step on the path to the creature leveling up. So I think we're done with this floor. We are. I've got most of this crap identified. I need to zap that wand at someone to see what it does. What's the other ring I want to put on? A ring of light or a ring of wisdom? Um, 
I guess light until I actually get something to use the Ring of Wisdom on. Right. And so I don't have to do it in the middle of a combat or anything awkward like that. Nah, I want to wait my food out. I don't want to waste any hunger. I just need two more points of strength. Oh, I did get another potion of strength. Goody. I just need one more potion of strength, and I will be able to... Hey, he had him off at the path. Good monkey. Definitely want to pop this bloat while he's over there. Now I can eat. Oh, that's a potion of strength. Alright, that's 15 strength. That's an axe. Equip. If I could get... Let's see, I got two scrolls of enchanting. I could put that on that plate armor. That would get it down to 16. At that point, all I need is one more enchant or one more potion of strength. So... Once we find either of those things, we're definitely going to make that happen. Let's break up this jackal party. Now that I have an axe, I should do significantly more damage. And this should be a decent run. Oh my god, I hit both of them. Axes are so good. The only thing about axes is it encourages you to fight in the open, which, while sometimes with an ally you do want to fight in the open, it's not, it's sort of counter to the traditional roguelike instinct to fight in as tight a space as possible at all times so that your enemies can only hit you one at a time. I'm trying to steal my dagger punk. I'll make a monkey out of you. Alright. I'm hoping my monkey levels soon. He should be getting there. Alright. Let me use this tungsten wand on the acid jelly. Oh, it's a wand of beckoning. I want my monkey to kill that acid mound if at all possible. Uh, it's asleep, apparently. Good monkey. Please kill all of those for me. Alright, I don't think anything of mine took corrosion damage, so that's good. Just mouse off the screen. Scroll of Summon Monsters, why ever I would want that. Orange Potion, oh you suck. Get that, scroll. Get that scroll. That's a scroll of enchanting. Alright, I got three scrolls of enchanting. That can take my plate down from 18 to 15. I'm doing it. Uh, spaced out for a second there. 16. 15. Put that plate armor on. Now I should have excellent defenses. So at this point I have a ring of transference, a good melee weapon, and excellent defenses. I can try to save my monkey with my cleaving strikes. I should not fear vampire bats at this point. I think I can squash them, actually. So at this point, an endgame weapon and tons more scrolls of enchantment would make me a happy camper. Alright, I should test some of these other potions before this potion to detect magic. Is that really all the magic on this floor? 
Alright, the orange potion is bad. I may just throw it at someone. Is that really all the loot on this floor? Oh, another pet. Alright. Starting to get a squad. Alright, we're going to throw some of these. Stand behind me, please. Thank you. That's an ogre. I can't. I wanted to lure him out so my guys could fight him, too. I should be okay, anyway. But the second I do that, one of them just steps in the way. Me and the ogre are missing each other quite a bit. Normally, I would never go toe-to-toe -to -toe with an ogre. Okay, that hurt. But my armor is going to make it that much less likely that he's going to hit me. I really have fantastic armor to be able to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with an ogre like that. Usually ogres are terrifying for me. Alright. Pit bloat. Do what you're going to do. I lost the gold. I think theoretically the gold's waiting for me on the next floor. Is that monkey flying? I think the monkey ate something when I wasn't looking, because now it looks like he can fly. He must have eaten a bloat. Alright, that's a shame. I'll be sure to look for that when I uh, go back, and I don't need a rapier. Although, that is a, a hint that I need to burn through more of this shit. Uh, scroll of Shattering. Orange Potion is bad. Scroll of Aggravate Monsters has no... Scroll of Summon Monsters, Scroll of Aggravate Monsters has no uh, genuine use. A Wand of Beckoning, it says it's bad, but I don't know. With a fighter build, being able to just, like, it's like a scorpion move. Like, come here. It's not so bad. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to... I'm just going to drop some of this shit. Um, don't want to Scroll of Aggravate Monsters. Don't want to scroll with summon monsters. Don't want three leather armors. Um. Don't really want a plus zero dagger. Is this mace actually enchanted? Good lord. Yeah, that monkey can definitely fly. He must have eaten a bloat. So I'm going to watch for that um, when I review this video. Oh, God. I should have known. Hey, there's my pets. Oh, God. Was that vampire bat defeated my goblin? It's okay. My monkey's still alive. I didn't realize those were my guys. I would have fought for him. I feel kind of dumb. Pop it and go. Smart monkey, smart monkey. I really just want to go back up. Okay, plus three ring of light. Oh, you, oh, you tease. You tease. Come on, monkey. Follow Papa. Really? How do I get to that? Thank you. Alright, hold on one second. I wish the sneeze would just get out of my body. It's really starting to annoy me. Alright, jelly. Me and my monkey gonna have words with you. Oh my god, I hit all the pe- Oh my god! <laughs> Axes are OP. 
do the same to these guys. All right, didn't I have incendiary darts? Yes, I do. Burn. Die in a fire. As they say. Yeah, it's going to catch all that grass on fire. But fire should break there, and we're going this way. No, another ogre, huh? Sleeping, sleeping, sleeping. Pow. Oh, half his health right there. Don't kill my monkey. Don't kill my monkey. Goody. Can I examine this monkey? Your monkey can steal items and flies. Okay. I don't think he steals items from me, but he flies. That's confirmed. Confirmed on Saint Stream. 15. Scroll of Enchanting. You killed my monkey! You killed my monkey! I'll get revenge for you, monkey. I'll get revenge for you, baby. I love you, monkey. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I let the mean things kill you. Alright, we can drop the scale mail. Alright. We can drop this band of mail, too. The only armor we need is this plate armor we're wearing. Now, I found another scroll of enchantment, but... Until my armor isn't really protecting me anymore, I don't want to put any more in the armor. Okay, so I guess I need to eat. Alright. And now we're done exploring this floor. And we're ready to go to the next depth. On the other hand, you know, pets are just kind of annoying sometimes. Except to deal with that acid mound. Um... Yeah, I'm going to throw an incendiary dart and catch that guy on fire. I think it'll burn to death. Of course, it'll catch all that on fire. I think that renewed the burn, actually. So, fire has very interesting properties in this game. you got to be careful with it. And I can step through the cinders here. And as soon as that patch burns away. Good. Alright. Oh, the ogre's on fire too. That's good. That did a good chunk of damage to him. A pressure plate clicks underneath me. No. Not going that way. Oh my god, that's so many acid blobs. I don't like this floor already. I don't want it corroding my fancy plate armor that I made. This would actually have been a good time to keep that, if I kept that banded armor. Okay, that's a spider. Strength 15, huh? Alright, I'm gonna throw some javelins at the spider. Apparently I can't hit the broadside of a bus, let alone the spider. Alright, I hit the spider. Keep hitting the spider. Alright, I'm poisoned. Poison will wear off. These webs are just annoying. Alright, so done with that. I just need something I can beat on and get health back. Yeah. That will work. Alright, can I throw? I want to try to hit the acid blobs with my orange potion, whatever that does. It caught him on fire. Perfect. I want to do that again if I can. Cool, that's going to burn through the webs as well. No, don't dive in the depths, are you kidding? I really don't want to face a bunch of acid mounds that are going to corrode my good gear. I plunged through a hole in the ground. Holy crap. Okay. 
Okay, did you just see that? That's four dead in their sleep. And it, yeah, yeah, it did wake everyone else up. That's okay. Now it's just me and this Goblin Mystic. Throw a Javelin. And that's the end of the Goblin Mystic. Hoping that spider didn't see me. I should have actually paid attention to whether or not he saw me. The spider is sleeping. Sleeping? Oh, I walked up to him when he sleep. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He did get a poison off on me. That sucks. But... I don't know. When I see those situations, I get so eager, I just go for it. Oh, God. Sleeping Wraith. I'd rather not go that way. Alright, I need to start using some of this crap I have. Um, could use a potion to detect magic. That's not going to give me a slot back. Actually, I think it will. Potion of life. I don't want to waste that yet. I guess drop the darts. Yeah, I don't see myself using those darts anytime soon. I can just drink this and then pick them back up, too. If I have a 16 strength now, I might switch to that mace. Yeah, let's do it. I know maces are slower, but this has some kind of enchantment or intrinsic on it. Alright, let's back up. Way too much going on in that room. If I have to, I'll back up into the web room because I'm sure... Am I just bashing on shielded goblins? I can't tell if I'm actually killing them. Do I have anything? No stabs. I have a potion of incineration. If I try to run though, they're just gonna get... This is really the best. They're just topping off that shield every round. This sucks. Gonna try to trap some people on webs. I think I got the enchanter, so that's good. Or not, yeah, the mystic. Alright, I just did a lot of damage to that wraith. I gotta be careful because they get one attack for every two attacks I get. Or they get two attacks for every one attack I get with the slow ass mace. But it does like twice the damage. So that's that's how that works. I really don't want to be fighting these little things all day. Um I wanna throw a javelin at this guy. Alright, that's the end of that. Now to go deal with these totems. Uh, wow. Alright, now I need to drink that potion of life. That was actually riskier than I needed to be. Alright, let's get out of there. I'll go around. Every time I check that, it's going to pop me with a lightning bolt. Cheap bastards. Alright. It's alright. What do we have here? Um, a staff of lightning would be great. This is a supplementary weapon for the next time I'm stuck in a situation like that. I can actually blast people behind the front line. This is a good time to test it as any. B. It's staff tunneling. That's actually not bad at all. I don't want to fight this thing. Apparently the ogre is as slow as I am. So that's good. If I keep fighting with this mace, we're going to know what its enchantment is, and then I'll be able to figure out if it's worth worth the trouble of using it. I'm really not fond of maces. Oh, 
Okay, here's something that's going to... Uh, I'm just going to throw fire at it. And that's a capital C. That's a centaur. That's uh, two centaurs. Uh, we're going to engage them as they come through the door because they do the pains. Killer Will O' Wisp. I'm going to engage these centaurs. It might be a lethal mistake. Ugh. Luckily, we got that centipede down. All right, what do we got to protect me? I could use a potion of invisibility. Yeah, that's what I want to do. Drink the potion of invisibility. And then kill the centaur. He's just going to run away from me while I'm invisible. All right, I need to throw javelins at him. Alright, I need to throw something else at him. I'm going to throw an incendiary dart. Alright, I'm just going to let him burn. Hopefully to death. He's still alive. Okay, I think he's dead now. I hope he's dead. Those centaurs are quite scary. Rip through this floor. It's a potion of strength. Drink that. ASAP. Inventory. Still using the bruiseriest weapon I have. Alright, now let's dive. And there's a centaur. He's already recovered most of his health. Oh. 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 It sucks to be you. Oh, one shot in an ogre. That's where these blunt weapons really shine, is when you can catch people unaware and one shot them. Also, it's situations like this where, alright, where like zombies are disgusting, you really don't want to hit them that many times because they just keep spewing out this n noxious fumes. Alright, what am I going to enchant? I could just put another... Yeah, I'll get the plate up to plus five. I'm starting to feel a little... And no. I'm actually... I know I'm being wishy-washy, but I'm going to wait until I have an endgame weapon. I'm going to enchant the crap out of it. I could put it in the Ring of Transference, but... Alright. I should have what it takes to survive a few smacks from these guys. They didn't even hit me. That's funny. Thanks for the key. Thanks for the free key, boyos. Alright, what do we have in here? A potion of life. And that's it. I'll take it. Potion of life is really awesome. It, it is kind of worthy of treasure room treatment. Because it's awesome. Oh, what kind of ring do we have here? We don't know because we're too full on stuff. Alright. What are we going to use? What are we going to use? It's a plus two mace. Yeah, that's pretty good. Um, what am I going to ditch? I'm going to ditch these darts for good. Let's identify this uh, ring. Identify the ring. Plus two ring of regeneration. I like it. We're going to take off the ring of light. I don't really care about rings of light. That's food. Do not step on the pressure plate, thank you. I can't hold that. A lot of sleeping creatures. Do I have something burning I can throw at it? Yes. I have incendiary darts. I have one more. I think this is worthy of it. Throw. Burn. Burn, burn. I 
and I'll just smash them as they run away. That was beautiful. That took out all of them. All right, let's take the scroll recharging. Oh, that's dope, dude. Scroll recharging. I don't really have any shit that needs recharging, do I? Not yet. I gotta use more of that wand of beckoning. I keep forgetting about that. That's gonna be actually a great wand for me. Like here. I'm gonna be I'm gonna beckon this zombie. Yeah, me throwing up. Hopefully it doesn't uh Yeah, before I try to Okay. Spider's awake. And I'm stuck. Hard. And... I think we're just gonna need to scrap this little bitch when he gets close. He's just spamming his webs. Alright, I'm poisoned. Being poisoned sucks. But it's not gonna kill me. I have a potion of life when I need it. That encounter with the spider could not have gone worse. Oh god. Oh god, don't keep me locked up here. Okay, I know what I need to do. While he's getting stuck on the web, I need to tunnel. It reflects off a stone wall. Please let me tunnel through here. It's not gonna happen. Alright, we're going to throw javelins at this thing. Still too much for the potion of telepathy, huh? Um, I guess at this point we can test these potions. Creeping death. Son of a bitch. That's just going to take over the whole floor. So we need to not go that way anymore. A scroll of protect armor? Oh, I want that. Um, I'll drop a gray potion for a second to pick that up and use it. And let's kill this pukey zombie that makes me pukey. I'm really hurt now, so potion of life. So many eels. I hate the eels. Pick up my darts. No way through here, huh? I guess we're done with this floor. Luckily I knocked that wraith out. Alright, so I think what I'm going to actually do is use uh, my scrolls of enchanting, or at least one of them, on uh, this ring of transference. And I'll save one. We gotta find an endgame. Oh god, why? At least my armor's protected now. If I knew how to scroll a protect weapon, I'd feel very, very comfortable right now. Let's throw a dart. Alright, I think what I'm gonna do is switch to my axe. Because I don't really care if my axe gets degraded. And now I've got a centipede. So now I need to switch back to my... This sucks. I need to switch back to my mace. Where is my mace? Okay, there it is. Kill the centipede. Switch back to my now shitty axe. And eventually I'm going to hit it. Alright. That sucked. Now I have a shitty axe. That's like minus six, I think it said. God, no. God. 
No, it's a dead end. Luckily, it doesn't. Those don't seem to. The the gas traps don't seem to last as long as the bloats. I need to search a little bit more. So when I'm walking around periodically, just hit the search key. A little annoying, but we'll save that ass. This is why I like to have a ring of awareness. Because it finds a lot of this crap for you. Alright, there's the way down. No. And the traps are only going to get hotter and heavier from now on. So, we gotta be careful. Finish that spark turret off. I don't know the way here, and I don't I can't be arsed to hunt it down, so staff of tunneling. Some magic a thing of magic. And hopefully the staff of tunneling has another charge. It does. Lovely. If I can stand here and get these goblins to come to me, which I don't see happening. Alright. Oh god, a bloat. I need to make, uh... No, don't dive in the depths. Hopefully that'll do some work to those goblins, or those totems. I don't know if bloats damage totems, but I hope they do. throw a javelin at this guy. I know we're running out of javelins. That does concern me a bit. It would be nice to have anything. Alright, we're gonna drop... Uh, okay, we're gonna throw this. We're gonna throw this potion of incineration I just got. Alright, is a burning ogre scary? Yes. But I just killed it in one shot. Alright, we're going to see what the scroll is. Scroll negation. We're going to see what this potion is. Oh god. I just want to change. You really? Yeah, without something to shield, you're pretty worthless. Okay, I don't want that troll to see us. If he shields that troll, I'm going to have a seriously bad day. Um, staff of tunneling. This way. I don't have any darts or javelins or. Oh, no, I still have javelins. Throw my last javelin. And it missed. Throw it again. And it one shot at him. Beautiful. I have another mace. Uh, I'm not in it. Well, I'll keep the mace and drop this minus seven axe. Um, next time I have to take out. I'll have one shot at that over here. Next time I have to take out, uh, you know. Um. Even this is going to be dangerous for me. Hopefully I can heal back up faster than they can hurt me. He's hasting them, which is scary.
You coward. I have nothing I can throw at it that will hurt it. Can't believe I haven't found a single staff. Oh, you know what? Fucking Wanda Beckoning. Come here, bitch. I got a potion of life. And we're done with this floor. Level 13. Can't be afraid. Oh, God. I hate Nagas. This, should, this build should be a little beefier when it comes to standing up to these things, though. Wow. I missed them like five times, though. I hate eels. Eels are just a nuisance at every level of the game. A sleeping centipede. Of course there's a hole in the ground. A troll and a wraith. Luckily the troll didn't see me. Alright, my pack is too full. Um, what can I drop at this point? I guess I'll drop these darts even though I have no throwing weapons. I have a wand of beckoning and I can recharge it multiple times. That's going to be my... What I have in... Oh god, I hate pixies. A grappling pixie. Alright, can I take a pixie and a wraith? Okay, well the wraith saw me. And now the wraith is getting out of dodge. Um, no, don't throw the wand of beckoning. I'm not going to let him get away. Oh god. Alright, use a scroll of recharging. Now. And I'm gonna actually beckon this pixie. Um, no, we're gonna get the ray. And of course I missed it. Whatever. I'll let the ray get away. A centaur. Hopefully the centaur... I thought the centaur said hunting. Oh, okay, there he is. Oh my god, screw these guys. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna have to make do work with beckoning wands. It only had one charge. No, I wanna throw these puny little darts I have. Oh, they came at me! Yeah, come at me, bro. You know you can't fight me like a real man horse. Here's a copper wand on it. I don't know what it did. I don't know what it did, but it made it killable for me. I'm just going to straight up use an identify scroll on that. I think it's a wand of entrancement. It's a wand of negation. Oh. That's awesome. That's bad. The pixie is confused. I think the pixie can do more harm confused than I can. And the pixie is going to be unconfused first. And there's a dark blade master. Who blinked right to me while I'm confused. Yeah. Alright. Now I really want to fight these one at a time. I can't hit these Dark Blade Masters. Alright, one hit did a lot of work. I'm going to have to drink that Potion of Life now.
Ugh, these pixies. Alright, these pixies are dead. <laughs> I just need to use doorways smartly to deal with them. I have a recharging charm. Lovely. I'm going to use the charm and then I'm going to beckon this. It's a will of the wisp. I'm not going to beckon that. So that recharging charm is something we pretty much want to use every single time it's up. I can't believe I survived those last two fights. Those were both very tense. Kill the Wraith. Awesome. So we survived a couple of very tense encounters. I'm feeling tense. Uh, yeah, I don't want a Potion of Darkness anyway. Oh god. A Dar Blade Ma two Dar Blade Masters and some kind of Dar buffer. And a troll. They have a cave troll. Stay calm, focus one at a time. Wow. Do I have a teleport? Oh my god. Take a second, look at anything that might be able to save your ass. I didn't think a troll would hit me that hard. Ugh. The only thing I can think of is to enchant my plate armor even more. And we'll enchant my ring of transference. Do damage. Stay alive. Alright. What am I going to do about this priestess? She shoots lightning, so fire immunity is not going to help. I'm going to negate her. Unless I can just kill her outright. Sweet. Alright, I'm gonna negate this. I gotta negate this ogre right now. Alright. Give me... Give me health. Alright, I had to go all in on my defenses to survive that, but... I might have died if I hadn't done that. So, I, I'm i healed all the way back up. Thanks to my... Oh god, ow! Alright, I have to eat. And then we have to rush this trap and destroy it. Alright, some kind of candlelit altar... I don't know what that is. Um, we're gonna walk through the the puke cloud. I'm gonna grab that potion. I can just toe to toe this dark blade master. I'm not as afraid of them anymore. And. Alright, we survived that floor. Getting very tense up in here. Um, what's even more unnerving to me... Oh god, more ogres. Luckily I did... Oh my god, look how I dispatched those ogres. What's more unnerving to me is that I need to find food. I should have killed that acid turret. That's okay. I don't even know what acid turrets do. They might melt my gear for all I know. But if it attacks me that way... Okay, yeah, I'm going to drop something to pick up that potion of strength. I'll drop a green potion. Naga. Please. Drink a potion of strength. If I had an endgame weapon, I would now have the strength to wield it. 
Alright, incendiary darts would help a lot. Um, I'm just gonna drink this mauve potion. Oh, that's horrible. Horrible. I'm gonna avoid fights as much as possible. The state I'm in, um, ugh, this is the worst place to get one of these. It could easily be the death of me. Alright, this thing is clearly coming after me. I'm gonna try to kill it before it kills me. It's something melee that I can kill. That's all I need to know about it. They're, see, they're swapping places, but I'm killing them both. I think I saw something shoot me. I don't know. This is actually kind of fun. <laughs> Although, it just takes running into the wrong thing and doing the wrong thing to it to really ruin my day. Uh, having to fight these guys more than one at a time would ruin my day, too. Yeah, they're not having it. This is a super dangerous situation I'm in. Made more so dangerous by that. I need to... Oh, why didn't I think of this sooner? Might be too late, but... Tunnel. Now I can fight them one at a time. Um, just gonna negate whoever is in front of me. And maybe that will help me kill it. I can't run from this. I killed something. I killed something. Okay. Okay. Staying alive. Killed another thing. Killed all the things. Staying alive. So remember that trick. That was sweet. For some reason, I'm doing no damage. At this point, I just want to wait out my hallucination and figure out why I'm doing no damage to this thing. Actually, I just want to negate it. Negate it. And now I should be able to do damage to it. Whatever it is. Is my charge back up? Not even close. Drink a uh, fire immunity. Yes. I care not for your fires. Dead Dar. And oh my god. And I'm dead. <laughs> I was trying to think of a place I could get to be safe. 